Welcome to The Rusted Garden. Today I'm going to show you how to take care of flea beetles on eggplants. I've done another video on this, but I've sort of modified it. As I continue to garden, I will use organic and non-organic products, but I try and use the right products in the right way, and I'll explain to you how I do that, because I'm going to use Seven Dust, which is a uh, insecticide that will kill all types of insects. I'm also going to use neem oil, but stick with me. I'm going to show you how I do this. This is flea beetle damage. Well, first of all, here's the flea beetles. One black dot, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. There's another one down there, nine. One under the leaf, ten. And I consider this an infestation. And when I have something that is greater than, you know, me just seeing the beginning damage, I use a stronger product and I use seven dust. You can use other products if you want, but in this case, you really do need to use a dust. And here are the flea beetles. And there are hundreds of holes in the leaves that came over the last two days. Neem oil probably would work on the flea beetles. They're chewing insects, but I don't want to wait three days. I want to take care of this problem now. This is seven dust. It's 5% uh, carbamyl in there. Carbamyl is a moderate to a higher end um, insecticide, so it will kill everything. You don't want to breathe this in. It's also been around for 50 years and I researched it and when I look at these more toxic poisons for instance copper uh, sprays and copper powders are organic but I would much rather accidentally breathe some of this in at the 5% ratio than breathe in uh, copper or get copper into my system. Either case you should wear gloves or just make sure you don't get it onto your body but don't use this in any kind of crazy way. Years and years and years ago when my grandfather taught me this would have gotten dusted everywhere but it kills everything. So back to the eggplant. Infestation, lots of beetles, hundreds of holes. How would I do this? It's actually the morning but I would do this now at nighttime at about seven o'clock. Take the dust, you're going to put it right on to your plant. Hit every leaf and this is going to kill the flea beetles immediately. So let's just pretend it's 7 o'clock at night. The good insects are away from here. I've tapped the plant, made sure no bees are around. But this dust, make sure you get all the leaves. I want to get even in here. On the stem where they crawl, down lower. So I've covered the plant. I'm trying to kill off the key beetles because again, it's an infestation in my opinion. Hundreds of holes in the last two days, maybe thousands. I don't want this eggplant to get stressed out. So it's seven o'clock at night. That's could actually get pruned out. Now I'm gonna cover it with a grocery store bag. If you have a bigger plant, use a bigger bag. If you have a smaller plant, use a smaller bag. And just Cover your cucumber for the evening. Give it a shake, get the dust going. This is gonna kill off the flea beetles by the morning. Now, the reason again I do this, infestation, lots of insects. I can't really wait for the neem oil. That's gonna take three days. I wanna wipe out the flea beetles. I wanna do it in a way that the dust doesn't get in other parts of my garden and, and kill off the good insects. I know seven dust will take care of the insects this evening, if it were the evening. So I do this at about seven o'clock at night, get the dust on, cover it up, 24 hours or 12 hours later, 7 a.m., which is about what time it is now, come out, remove this, the flea beetles will be dead, and then, oh, well, technical failure. So I would take my hose, although I didn't turn it on, I'm not gonna run over there, and then wash this down. Wash off the dust, get it out of the way, get it on the ground, and then your flying insects that are coming in aren't gonna land on this. And then again, let's just move it. So consider that washed off, and here's the washed off plant. So this is my other eggplant. So now that it's the morning, I've washed the dust off, I've taken care of the immediate infestation, I'm gonna get my neem oil and spray it down, spray the undersides, and start doing this weekly to stop the infestation of the flea beetles from coming back. 
Hope you enjoyed this video. Get an understanding of how you can use more hazardous insecticides in a sensible way. I do believe in that. I believe most products have a good use in the garden if you use them sensibly. Please check out my blog at www.therustedgarden.blogspot.com and also check out my YouTube videos. Thanks.